Hi guys, Tevik here and welcome to episode 18 of Minecraft Season 3. So I'm just recrafting myself the Nano Suit Leggings. We're gonna need another backpack. So let's see, woo, I don't have any here. I don't actually know where I have any wool. Um, oh well, we're gonna do that later. I removed my enchanting table because I wanna try something new. Um, uh, we have a few cool things, like um, this here little toy that I got, the magic table. And also uh, this one here, which is the research table. Okay, just gonna plop these down, looks like a gift. Okay, I have no idea how this works now, but I do know that if I do this. Let's see. Um, let's do... I'm gonna grab a... I'm gonna grab some flint. Also gonna grab some gold. Flint and gold. Right. Now, paper with flint makes a scroll of sharpness. And that makes a scroll of lucky. I am just winging this. I am not sure if this even works. Um, let's request two diamonds. Do I have any sticks? Yes. Gonna make a new sword and see what we get out of this. There we go, diamond sword. It's not even used. I need a dust. So, how does it work? Hmm. Maybe I need to put it in the enchant normal enchanting table first. Right, so with my 23 levels. Oh, right. Let's uh, move all this up to my house since I do have some more. There we go. I have my nice list of bookcases. So in this episode, I want to do a little bit of thumbcraft, a little bit of everything, and just play around, Gen just, yeah, pretty much play around and see what I can do. There we go. I can place that there, and that magic table can go there. Now, let's see what we can do. This is what I don't like with this. Da -da -da. 17, 19. There's a lot of clicking and trying to find one. I'm gonna go for the next near 20. Did I have 20? Yes. 19. Okay, we're gonna go for 19. That gives me a slot 2. Now, if I understand this right, I can get diamond dust from this of quality 2. Okay. Or just put in that, and it will enchant my weapon to looting 2. Nice. Let's do that. What happens if I put that in? I get some low quality diamond dust. Okay. Can I do anything else like put that in? No. Okay. Well, I'm gonna have to play around with this. Um, I do need to build myself some kind of experience farm. And I know exactly where to put, build that. Oh yes, you guessed right. The end. Now, there are a lot of designs for, uh, for uh, ender spawners and stuff like that. And I don't really know how to build one, so I'm gonna do a lot of research off camera for that. 
so I probably won't make it this episode. Um, but we should probably get started with Thorncraft, shouldn't we? Yeah. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna need to make some books. Three, to be exact. Because these books makes a bookcase. Perfect. We're also gonna need a gold nugget and a shard. Yay! I have myself a wand. And I'm not afraid to use it. I promise. So, um, this will make myself uh, an enchanting table, kind of. And now the question is, where do I want to build my thumbcraft thing? I'm going to plan a little bit, maybe build a little bit, and I will see you guys in a while. I'm thinking maybe here, like a tower out of this. Of course, magic has to be done in a tower, right? Well, I'll see what I'll cook up. See you in a bit. Alright, so I made sort of a towery thing that will extend up here. And did I turn that off? Yes, I did. Uh, it will extend up. I haven't uh, done much on it. Um, it will just be for the absolute basics. And for now, the entrance is here. Won't be here later, of course. Okay, so let's do this. There we go. We will start by making... Oh, we need to make a table, don't we? Yes. Pretty sure we need to make one of... Is that the way? Yes, one of these. We start with that. We get our wand and... Booyah! We have a crafting table. Now, can we break this? I just need to test. Yes, oops. And that is an arcane work table. Perfect. And now, doing this will make the Thomonomicon. Now, this is where the cool stuff starts. Oh, yes. There's a lot to do here. A lot of research that we need to kind of explore. And I don't know how it works. We're gonna need that. Scribing tools. Glass files. Well, a glass bottle, feather, and ink sack. That shouldn't be too much problem. Um, tables. Crucible. We're gonna need a normal cauldron, some kind of heat source. What the hell? You steal my cacti. Did he teleport as he died? Yes, he did. Okay, so we need to make a cauldron. And this is just a normal kind of cauldron. Let me dump a few things. And I think that's something like this. Yes. What kind of heat source do we want? More importantly, where can we place it? Actually, if that is kind of the research room, I can build into the mountain just behind, just to save us a little bit of time. That will do, that will do. Um, right. So, once we step up here, this will kind of be the area where we do the research, or just build some stairs. Well, we'll see, we'll see. I'm not decided yet. Um, the cauldron needs to go somewhere, though. Um, let's go with this place. Hmm. Actually, no. Or maybe. No. Let's uh, place the cauldron. Oh, come on. 
There we go. I'll just make a space for the cauldron here for now. And uh, that's behind... <laughs> this is trickier than I thought it would be. Uh, since this is kind of on top of my whole construction here. I kind of want to test this out, so... Gonna have to remove the status HUD, I think. Because that will kind of interfere with. with this. So. Heat source. There we go. Could probably put lava just below it as well, but this will do. This will do. And then we do, boing, and this is a cauldron. Awesome. Um, I will be restructuring and moving this around, but I figure since we are going to need to make, hmm, of course, no glass. Let's go and grab some of that then. Um, let's make a stack of glass. This crafting table can go really, but... Let's request one ink sack and one feather. I think that's the way. That's glass bottles, yes. Ink and feather. And we have scribing tools. Awesome. And now we're also going to need to make two more of these tables. I'm going to dig this out. I'll pretty this up a little bit, but I kind of like the heavy style for this. Um, but I will pretty it up, definitely. Um, let's put this there. Are we ready? No, that's not the way to do it. Oh. How do you make the scribe? Oh, of course, I'm silly. Um, I made the tools just for that, didn't I? Well, uh, these are worth some stuff, so we can put them back later. Okay, let's try this again. I'll put it up to the f wall, I think. And the scribing tools. Boom. Now this is where the fun st starts. Okay, what do we want to do? Um, we do have that. We have that. We do need to make some of these. We've got the research table. We've got the scribing tools. We have the thomonomicon. We have some tables. And that's all we need. Um... I'm gonna have to start doing some serious research here. And I'm not really sure how this will work, but let's just put that in. And it's got wood. Uh, what about that? It's got three vitreous. And there's something I can do with it. I'm gonna need a lot of paper for this, aren't I? Um, what I'm gonna do is set up a request system down here, so we can request stuff from our chests here, so we don't need to run for them back. I'll do that off camera between this and next, though. Um, let's uh, research... Um, I think gold nuggets... Um, redstone... Possibly coal... 
Hmm, something like that. Okay, so if I research coal, it has ignis and potentia. There we go. Each time I click now, something will happen. I got unknown theory for the coal. There we go. Uh, we have two known elements here. And um, there is a text there that doesn't quite work. I'm doing cursory. Okay. What do we know about this? Oh, it's Nitor. And Nitor is 35% complete with Potentia. And let's... Okay. It knows... The glowing flame seems to be fueled by magic itself. The number of uses for an ever-burning flame seems endless, but unfortunately it doesn't seem to produce much heat. Though it could prove to be a steady source of light and energy. Light. I would think redstone. Let's get that. Okay, so that is research. Let's put in some... We need to have something that has light. I know something that has light. Glowstone. We put in that. It has light. And Visum. There we go. I could probably go do a thorough research. Research. We'll use up more, but... There we go. I have the discovery. Night tour. There we go. I have learned night tour. That's awesome. Looking at the Thalmonomicon, I can now craft this. It's crafted in the crucible, and I will need to make some kind of energy source here. Let's do that. Well, not energy source, water source. Do I have a bu bucket? No. A bucket here. No. But there. Yes. Um, I'm thinking we should make this an aqueous accumulator just for fun. So let's craft that. Um, I'm gonna craft this off camera. You've seen me do it several times already. Okay, so I set up a little bit of a base kind of thing here. Um, with some request pipes, and this is an extractor, so this is whenever I want to send something out, I can put it there. Um, I'm gonna hook this up now, once I get... There we go. This should pump water straight into this. Yep. And now we'll wait for this to bubble. And it's bubbling. Awesome. Now, the way this works, I can't check on this here, but uh, I'm gonna. This looks like a nugget. Um, looking at this, I need ignis, lux, and potentia. We know that f um, coal had both of these, uh, so I'm going to request up some charcoal. And we also know we need Lux. So this does take a little while for things to get up here. There we go. And there we go. Now we know this has two and two and this has that. So we're gonna be crafting to make some of this night door. We need four Ignis, four Potentia. That's Two coal, and we need six glowstones. Oh, two glowstones. So let's put in one, two, and one, two. I think that will make us a nitor. Awesome. Now I have no idea what this can be used for. I wonder. Can we research this? Probably shouldn't research that. Um, cool. 
I suppose. Uh, I'm actually going to request up. I don't happen to have any chests in the... Okay. One moment then. I'll just go and grab one. There we go. And doesn't look like the pipes had anywhere to go. Neither did that. Neither did that. And pipes can go in there with the waterproof. And glass in there. We're gonna need some of that. And I'm gonna have to set up some sort of glass making. Um, I can probably do that. Um, I wanted this one there so I can store all the things that I try. Now... Um, there's a lot of things that I could research. Let's pick something... Uh, cobblestone's probably not gonna cut it. Let's grab some iron. Let's grab a bunch of it. Ten. And then let's grab some gold nuggets. Actually, ten. And let's grab some wood planks and maybe some sand. I suppose I could research beef as well. I have no idea what I'm doing with this. I admit. Let's put that in. Oh, Redwood does not have anything on it. It's probably better to just grab that. Okay, let's try that. Okay, we have an unknown theory. Awesome. Okay. Alimentum. Um. Okay. Is that part of it? Yes, it is. So let's uh, do a cursory. No, thorough. It doesn't look like metallum is part of it. What about sand? No. What about that? No. Okay, we just found two more of these. We need potentia. Power! Um, there is none of that in there. Alimentum. Let's uh, grab a bunch of charcoal. Let's actually grab a block or two. And there's that part of it? No. Okay, so it looks like Potentia, Ignis, and Fractus makes the Alimentum. We have a discovery. Alimentum. This substance throbs with fiery energy and is, it is more than eager to release that energy at the slightest bump. It may be unstable, but it could probably make a good source of fuel. Cool. Let's check this. Okay. So now Nitro and Alimentum... It's probably not a good idea to throw it against a solid surface. Okay, fair enough. This looks like a gold nugget. Can I research that? Well, we do have an unknown theory of something. Suppose that's still metal. Metallum? Now I'm curious. Actually... It's probably better to just do that on that. Yeah, we're gonna send that back. Grab the tin. Since it has alimentum. Well, it has metallum and vitreous. Okay, so we know that. Oh! Transmutation. Okay, so vitreous is not part of it. Hmm. That is not part of it. Hmm. 
Nope, not part of it. Interesting. So research seems to waste a lot of materials. Let's get some gold and some diamonds. Okay. Keras and Metallum. And the last one is Exchange. Hmm. They don't seem to have it. I don't know. What could have exchange? I'm thinking maybe bones. They exchange with the dead. I don't know. Maybe saplings, since they kind of exchange with the ground. Nope. 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 Hmm. Wheat? Let's go down to the chests and uh, kind of explore what has that exchange symbol. Not lapis. Uh, not that. Silver dust. Silver ore has it. Seeds have it. I don't don't have seeds, so that's not gonna be a possibility. I suppose it's silver ore then. Flint has... Oh, I'm gonna have to try flint. I am really, really liking the new way of... Oh, silver ingots have plenty. Let's get that. Bronze has two. Let's get, get some of that. It's tin and gold. Well, tin and copper for that, so it's pretty cheap. Okay. Silver had Permu permutatio. And we needed some more of the gold, and we have basic transmutation. Studying the rudiments of alchemy and the properties of metals, you think you might have stumbled upon a way to transform base metals into gold. Let's see on that. Keras and metal makes a gold nugget. It's pretty expensive. Right, indeed I have felt that I do need to do that. What's that? Hmm. Is paper anything I can study? Okay. There's something in it. Okay, so there is something on learning. A thermometer? Well, what could that one need? Nothing of that. Nothing of that. Nothing of that. Maybe that then. No. Not sand. I'm thinking magic, but I'm not going to throw this in there. Uh, wow. I have no idea. Let's grab three of each shard. Maybe some peat. I wonder how long I've recorded. Um, Pete does not actually have a reaction. Oh well. Doesn't really matter. 
Okay, so definitely sorcery. And something else. Ah. Uh, what else did I get? We need to know... I'm thinking maybe... I have some extra stuff here that I'll just check and see what they are. Learning is done. We need more magic, so that's gonna come from this one. That's needing... Gina. Um... I have no idea what actually has that device. Don't I have a piston? Maybe a pressure plate. Let's get four of these. This one has it. Cool. Now, a pressure plate. Fences didn't have anything of use there. Pressure plates do. They're pretty cheap as well. Let's put that in and... Ah. Come on. Yeah. Pressure plates do work. So let's make a bunch. There we go. I have discovered the thermometer. Oh, let's see. That's that the one. That's a water shard and gold ingots to make one of these. Hmm. A lot of cool things that I see here. Um Yeah. One moment, guys. And I am way over time, so I'm not going to continue this episode. But I am going to have to see you guys in the next one. I will do some research off camera and uh, see what I can figure out. Like, for instance, flint. It's got to have something with the instrumentum and saxum. Who knows? Um, I will see you guys in the next episode, in which we will do some more research. Well, I'll do most off-camera, I promise. In the next, I'll start playing around with this one and see what I can come up with. Alright, see you later. Bye-bye.